you need to know and believe that the scripture is sufficient this is crucial because part of the tricks and strategies of false teachers is to downplay the sufficiency of scripture to these people the bible alone is not enough to give us the words of god they have to seek special revelations apart from the bible and thereby receiving the doctrines of devils the bible says that all that god wants to tell us in these last days he has spoken it through his son and that's jesus christ you can read about that at the beginning of the book of hebrews we are encouraged to hold on to that which we have received from the beginning that's very important first john chapter 2 is very popular with this verse 24 let that therefore abide in you which ye have heard from the beginning if that which ye have heard from the beginning shall remain in you ye also shall continue in the son and in the father you need to stick with what we have been given in the bible the Bible is so complete and so sufficient that it issues a warning to anyone who will add to it or remove from it. That, my brethren, is a testimony to its sufficiency. See, God exalts his word above his name, the Bible says. Think of how powerful the name of God is. God places more value on his word than he places on his name if the word of god is that important then we must take it seriously study it live it share it contend for it as we are commanded in the scriptures stay away from new revelations you don't need them stick with the bible it is sufficient for faith for life, for godliness, and truly all that you need to live the Christian life.